And this is Sweet Jill coming back at you. As you can see, I'm out here to our dead mall. And they closed our Sears. They closed our Sears store. I'm trying to figure out when they closed it. Um, they closed it a few months back. And as you can see, I'm going to zoom it in. And let you see that's the auto center. Well, I don't I know there's there's people on here that do those store closing videos and things like that. That's not my platform. So uh I'm not that's not what I'm doing. But the reason why I'm showing this is because I read on CNN the CNN at um an article for CNN and they said that Sears, you know they're closing Sears is closing, they're closing Kmart Sears and Kmart is owned by the same people. They've been closing stores all over the country. Now if you go to Manny Quack Y'all, um, Wally B, go to their channels and they do the Kmart videos. The Kmart closings and Sears closings. Uh, retail Archaeology does those things too. But Manny Quack Y'all and uh, Wally B. Uh, it's another one here on here too but I, I can't think of his name right now. They do the the Sears and you know they go through the, they do the Kmart videos and the Sears videos. So you want to see that? Check out their stuff. That's their platform. But the only reason why I'm showing this is because when I read that they said, dude, all them years that people work for Sears and they had retirement um, 401ks or retirement funds. I'm sure that they had a lot of employees that put in a lot of clock in a lot of years. So they had a little retirement thing going on. Well now we all know that Sears they filed bankruptcy. And I guess now I don't know I know I know about business to a degree. Because I took I was studying business in college, but I don't know everything about business. But I think when they file, correct me if I'm wrong, but I think if they file when they file bankruptcy, a major corporation like this, when they file bankruptcy, they um, they don't have to pay those retirement funds to people. Correct me if I'm wrong. They said in the beginning of the bankruptcy proceedings, he promised to pay people their pensions. But now he trying to renege on the deal and, and trying to beat people out of their money and not trying to pay their money. That is not cool. That is not okay. They done closed this Smart Sears. They've been open for years since the 80s. They closed, they've been closing Sears and Kmarts all over the country. They closed our Kmarts, which is across town. They've been open for since the 60s. Uh, now go to Manny Quack, y'all. He's, he does those Kmart closings. Um, they've been closing Kmart's and Sears. Because Sears and Kmart's is owned by the same people. They've been closing them all over the country. And they're going, they, they filed for bankruptcy. And now they're trying to beat, beat their employees out of their retirement. And see, this is the kind of things where people want to complain about food stamp, people getting food stamps and Section 8 and things like that. See, this is the kind of things that I'd that I be talking about. We, we don't never know what's going to happen to us. Now, these people don't that might have put in 25, 30 years with Sears don't have their, not going gonna to have their retirement money. And we all know that Social Security don't drop a whole lot of money. You don't get a whole lot of money with Social Security. You got to have some other things going on besides Social Security. Okay. Now, these people may not get their retirement because this man is greedy. He trying to beat people out of their retirement. And see, this is the kind of thing I'm talking about. We don't never know what's going to happen to us. When people want to come advocate and complain about them cutting these programs, you don't know what's going to happen to you. These people probably didn't even know that. Some of these people clocked in probably 25, 30 years with this company. Now they might, they're facing the possibility of not getting their retirement. They're closing up, filing bankruptcy, and now they're going to be beating people out of their money. And some of those people may be retirement age and time to collect their Social Security, hoping that they was going to collect their retirement in addition to the Social Security. Okay. Now they're looking at not even getting their Sears retirement. You see what I'm saying? 
We don't know what's going to happen to us. It's stuff like this. The way this, this system is greedy. And it's getting worse and worse as time is getting near for time for Jesus to come back. Bible says the man men will be lovers of themselves and and and, it's, and we see an evidence of it every day I, I read that go on CNN.com I read that it came across my phone on when I was on Facebook but yeah I said yeah let me go out here and this is the reason why I'm shooting this okay they, this is our series at our dead mall they closed up okay they didn't close them all over the country mm -hmm. So see, this is the kind of thing that I'm, I'm talking about, guys. This is what they do. We don't know. Now, these people might, might not get their money. Okay? They, they, they're trying to beat these people out of their retirement. And these people paid into that. When you got that kind of thing, you pay into it. They take a little piece out of your check. Okay? Now, when I worked at Myers, I got a little retirement because I had six years in all together. Because I worked for Myers twice. I didn't even know I had it coming, you know, until they let me know. And I had, I had a little retirement. They could have beat me out of it because I didn't even know I had it. But they was honest enough to let me know that I had it. But these people are dirty. This man that owned this Sears Corporation, he dirty. Eddie Fer uh, Lambert or something his name. He dirty. He's greedy. And you know what? Well, God going to deal with him. God going to deal with him. He's trying to beat people out of their money. I, I just, I, I said, I, oh, I, oh, I got to talk about it. I have to talk about it. See, he, they didn't close our Sears and a lot of other ones. And now he's trying to take the money and run. They say he promised in the beginning to pay people. Now he's trying to take the money and run. Let me know. Please like, subscribe, and share. Let me know what you think in the comment section. Go to CNN.com to read that. But this man is dirty. And God going to deal with him. Okay. Let me know what you think in the comment section. Like, subscribe, and share. Hit that notification bell. I got some more video topics coming up. This is Sweet June.